What do you have against red gummy bears? Red gummy bears? Oh no, Cameron said something. Cameron said something. Um. What is it? I, I heard you got something against them. Like, uh, you don't I like don't, them? Or... I don't personally have anything against them. Okay. It's just, there was one day, I was, uh, we were hanging out, and I was like, the next one, whatever color it is, I'm just going to throw it at you. And it happened to be red. So now every time I see a red gummy bear, I have to, like, throw it at him. <laughs> nice, nice. <laughs> what, uh, what shirt size are you wearing today? What shirt size? I am wearing a small. A small? What, yes. what shirt size should you be wearing? small. Is that right? Yeah. I heard you like to wear your shirt sizes a little Probably small. <laughs> <laughs> what can you tell me a little about Red Octobers? Oh, out of my price range. <laughs> That's for sure. <laughs> Would that be like uh, like your dream shoe to get a hold of some Red Octobers? Probably. I'll probably, before I do like a house or wife or kids or anything, I'll probably just do that first. That's a game plan. <laughs> my fiance isn't here, is she? No, she isn't know. <laughs> what happened with your road bike? What? So... <laughs> I was biking with my parents, and I wasn't even going that fast, and then my foot caught on the ground somehow, and then I <laughs> my elbow. <laughs> Got the scar to, scar to prove it, right? Yes. What can you tell me about a time there was a ponytail that got cut off and maybe displayed in the karate school? Oh yes, there was indeed. And actually, I, I we were the bodor at the time, and I had a long braid. It was a braid, not a ponytail or a rat tail. Um, and then yeah, it got cut off, and for whatever reason, ended up like on a shelf in the office for like ten years. <laughs> Is that right? Yeah, and we all thought it was weird, but it was like, well, maybe if we don't talk about it, it'll go away, and it didn't go away. Now it's coming back 20 years later. So here we are, thanks for that. So I've also heard that you are a little bit of a story embellisher. It doesn't sound like me. It doesn't sound like you, okay. Well, yeah, I noticed you got a chain on. Would you mind telling us how much your chain is worth? Oh, this old thing? I was passed down from my grandparents when they came over from Guatemala. Uh, it's been in our family for years. I'm joking. I don't remember how much I bought this for. It was like garage sale, thrift store. I don't know. I've had it for forever. So 20 bucks maybe? Probably. Maybe more? Yeah, I, I got it for maybe a more. I think even less. I heard you don't like to tell people how much your jewelry is worth. No, no, that's just my fiance. <laughs> I keep her in the dark. <laughs> So I, I just wanted to say one word. I want you to tell me a little bit about this, okay? Are you ready? Light switch. Oh, okay. So, um, for Mr. Vine was talking to me about, like, or just talking in general, about, like, putting that switch on to, like, compete and, like, get ready. So, for Christmas, my dad got me a light switch, and I carry that around with me everywhere, like, and then, yeah. That's pretty awesome. So you're you're talking literally like a light switch. Oh, yeah. I don't know. It reminds you to turn the light switch on. That's awesome. That's awesome. Um, how is Milo doing? Milo, uh, she's good. I hope she's doing good. I saw her this morning. So who um, is Milo? Milo's my hamster. <laughs> <laughs> is Milo a bit of a Spider-Man? She likes to tell herself that. Is that right? <laughs> she likes to climb the cage a lot, but she's not like coordinated at all. So she kind of just like ends up like dangling like back and forth like by one like claw and then like falls on her like falls on her head every type of way and then she'll just look at me like did you see that? Did you see that? And then she'll come back up and do it again. I'm like, can't do anything about it. Also, I, I just wanted to, I wanted to say one thing to you. I wanted to just kind of get your take on this, okay? Yeah. Billy Goat's Gruff. Do you have any connection to Billy Goat's Gruff? Indeed I did. What is, what is Billy Goat's Gruff? Um, it was a play that I did back in first grade. Okay. Um, what was uh, what was your character? What did you... Um, I did the troll. Were you a good... Were you the big bad troll? I was the big bad Billy troll. Billy Goat's Gruff.